Hey guys, I'm back. Full on. Let's do this. January favorites. Go. So my, my first favorite, first fashion favorite, are these boots. I got them in Primark in Portugal, actually. Uh, oh, that's my favorite, the trip to Portugal. It was awesome. Um, so these are uh, just black booties. They have this, I don't know if you can see this cool detailing here, like little holes almost and they are just technically lace up but they also have zippers here and this really nice golden detailing around the heel and they are very comfortable uh, they are waterproof which has been very useful recently because the weather has been awful um, so yeah I just love them they go very well with almost all of my outfits so yeah I've been wearing them almost every single day since I got them in the beginning of the month my second favorite is also kind of um, the result of my trip to Portugal because I saw it on the airport uh, while we were waiting because our flight was delayed of course um, and this is this oh, beautiful beautiful little beige bag from Parfois. I didn't buy it at the airport. I decided to to wait but then I came back home and the next day I bought it. So <laughs> yeah this is how much I love them. It's, it has a long uh, faux leather uh, strap so it goes uh, crossbody and it has two compartments main one here which opens just with this little magnetic clip and then the second one which is more secure because it has this little buckle here and the co compartment is smaller but you can uh, put your phone here or your keys just something that you don't want to lose or don't want any that don't want anybody to steal it um, so yes, I've been loving this bag and every time I go out uh, somewhere that I don't need my huge bag or backpack, I, I've been carrying this and I love it. So my first beauty favorite is actually a combination of products and that has been doing wonders for my skin and it is the L'Oreal uh, face oil that I've talked about in my skincare routine a few months back. Uh, I've been loving it a lot because my skin is really dry right now. And what I do is I mix it with my uh, moisturizer. This is just a regular cheap drugstore moisturizer, moisturizer nothing special. So uh, at night I take a lot of the cream and I put around three to five drops of this. I mix it together and apply it to my skin and it sinks in through the night. Uh, it actually sinks in uh, very slowly. That's why I use it only at night, this, this much of the, of the oil, because it sinks in very slowly, but it does leave my skin uh, feeling great the, in the morning, very soft, very moisturized. And what I use in the morning, I use a smaller amount of, my, of the face cream and with just one drop of oil and I add to it, yes I know it's a lot but my skin is very dry, I add to it the L'Oreal Paris uh, Skin Perfection Serum and it, it's just, oh, I, I think I, yeah, I, I did buy it this month, probably like two weeks ago, maybe three, and it's been great. My skin has been feeling and looking great. And this actually works really well also as a primer uh, for your makeup. So yep, yeah, I love it. So speaking about makeup, I have found the best BB cream or actually there's a CC cream ever and it's 
one two three perfect CC cream from Bourjois looks like this I have it in the color 31 ivory this stuff has better coverage than some of my foundations but it still feels and looks very natural it does feel uh, oh, sorry it you know quite moisturizing throughout the day and it stays on uh, I just set only my t-zone a little bit uh, with uh, some powder and that's it it stays on it looks gorgeous it looks very natural it doesn't uh, oxidize or anything and yep yeah, I've been loving it it's great Mwah. and to apply it I've been actually using a new brush uh, a few months ago I think at the end of uh, what was it November I bought myself a present uh, for surviving a very difficult month at work. I bought myself a set of 15 uh, makeup brushes from Zoeva and there's been one that has just changed my life, changed my makeup. I love it to death and it's this little or actually big foundation brush. This is the 104 buffer brush oh my god it's so soft it's so dense it feels like like I, I don't know like the softest cotton or something that you can brush your skin with and it it makes the foundations go on very smoothly and looks and it, it makes everything look flawless and I love it and it's just beautiful I don't know what I've been doing with my life before I found you. Thank you. If I continue to kiss every single product that I have, we're gonna be here for a while. So, moving on. Uh, another part of the gift that I bought myself back then in November is this. Can you see that? This is an eyeshadow palette from uh, Makeup Revolution. It has 144 shades. I know, it's crazy, it's huge, it's very impractical, you can't travel with it. But it's just beautiful and the shadows, the pigmentation of the shadows is amazing. I'll try and I'll swatch some for you. I'll swatch one like very dark and one very light. So starting here, for example, look at this. This is just gorgeous. They are very nice quality, creamy and pigmented. And look at that sparkly black. Oh. And you can you can do pretty much. Come on, if you have 144 shades, you can do any look you want. And it's just, it's awesome. And recently I've been needing some crazy shades because it does have a lot of crazy shades that you don't use every day, but I've been needing them recently because I've been doing theater makeup and I love it. It's just, it's everything I've ever wanted. I, oh, I adore this palette. And to make the eyeshadows from this palette stay longer on my eyes, I've been using uh, the eyeshadow primer, it's called actually Eyeshadow Keeper from Inglot. It looks like this, comes in a tube, it's very creamy and it just makes your eyeshadows blend in very nice and stay on for a long time. So yep, yeah, I've been loving it, it's changed my life and I have nothing more to say about that. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> so to keep everything nice and clean uh, and by everything I mean my brushes I've been using baby shampoo this is a baby shampoo from Johnson Johnson & Johnson regular baby shampoo from the drugstore cheap and it gets the job done my brushes have never looked and felt better love it And for the random non-beauty or fashion related uh, favorites, I have uh, my favorite TV show of the month 
and it has to be Pretty Little Liars. Pretty Little Liars came back five, uh, five uh, years later and I love it. Like People are saying that it's repetitive, but for me it's not. I love it, it's great and the girls look gorgeous. Let me know if you want to see uh, like new makeup, uh, new Pretty Little Liars makeup uh, the five years forwards, whatever, uh, makeup looks because I've been loving it. They look gorgeous and the story is great. If you haven't seen Pretty Little, Pretty Little Liars, yeah, what have you been doing with your life? It's a great show and okay, there has been, they are in the in their sixth season, season right now, so we have a lot of catching up to do, but it's worth it. So go watch that now. And if you don't want to watch Pretty Little Liars, I've been loving, I know, I'm a nerd, I've been loving the entire Star Wars saga. I've watched the um, new film, oh, actually on the 1st of uh, January, and I loved it, I think it was really good. It was very similar to, uh, what was it, New Hope. Uh, the one of the previous uh, previous parts, but I loved it anyway. I loved uh, Ray. I think she's a very cool character, and I I can't wait to see what they what they do with her. And yep, yeah, it it was a great movie, and it inspired me to rewatch the previous ones. And I'm yeah, I watched the the new trilogy, so uh, the films with. Natalie Portman, oh, love her, uh, and Hayden Christensen, and I, I've been loving it, and now I'm planning on watching the old trilogy, because who doesn't love Star Wars? Yeah, who doesn't? <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Never mind. <laughs> okay, so that's actually it for today. I hope you enjoyed my favorites. Let me know what you've been loving the past month in the comments down below. Let me know what uh, videos you want to see from me. I promise I will be uploading more than throughout the last three months because yeah, it's been a tough time for me. But I'm back and I will uh, stay here for a while. That's the plan. Um, so yeah, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment down below and subscribe to my channel. And yeah, I will see you guys very soon. Bye.